tactics can be confusing in Football Manager. Should I be going wide? Short? Deep? Should I be pressing high? Will the team get tired? Will I get tired making the tactic? I'll show you the quickest, easiest method for making a winning tactic in Football Manager. I'll prove to you how I know this, I will show you how good it is, and we'll discuss what this means about Football Manager 24 tactics overall. So here's secret number one. Use a preset. Now it's quick and easy, but before you run off and go and pick out any old preset, do not. There are many terrible presets out there. Terrible presets. How do I know? Well, I've run them all through our test league. If you want to know more about that, I'll put a link up here or down in the description below. But using this test league, we can identify formations, styles, overall tactics to find what's the best preset. So you can just go click, click and be on your way to winning a load of games. So looking solely at just formations on their own with no instructions whatsoever, I've run all of the preset formations alongside another couple of random ones, which believe it or not was not the worst. That honor goes to the 442 narrow, which I used to love in previous FMs, but now it's done me a dirty the last couple, I can't use it anymore. I really struggled trying to make something work with it. If anybody's got a successful 442 diamond, let me know in the comments down below. Of the top formations, it's the 4222, which comes out on top, along with an old favorite, a 4132 DMAM narrow. But this is just naked tactics. What really matters is style. And this is the first option you have when you go to pick your preset. Do not pick Park the Bus or Cantonaccio. Don't do those. The top four are wing play, fluid counter-attacking, vertical tiki-taka, and gagain pressing. As always, the number one. They keep trying to dial it down every year, but the guys don't get tired enough. It's still effective. Now, these teams all have 25 players, so there's a good amount of rotation going on, but they are playing like two games a week every week for a year. If you've made it this far, be sure to subscribe for more FM24 tactical breakdowns going forward. So there's plenty of time for them to get tired out, but within each of these styles, there's multiple formations you can pick. Let's break them down. They're color-coded, so fluid counter-attacking is in the pink, gagain pressing is in the yellow, vertical tiki attacker in the green, wing play in the purple. We can see actually the 4-3-3 DM wide doesn't work very well for either the gagain pressing or the vertical tiki attacker. And actually it's one of the other two formations you want to play if you want to play either of those styles. But the top dogs are truly the 4-2-4 wide gagain pressing and the 4 2 3 one DMAM wide giga impressing. They're also still very good with the vertical tiki taka too. Though what really interests me here is that none of these styles actually contain our top formation, which was the 422222. So I reckon there's room to experiment with that with some instructions going forwards. And now you've got a successful formation, check out this video to get the best out of your corners. Enjoy your football manager, guys. I'll catch you in a bit.